Welcome to Trending Celebrities. ASAP Rocky responds to ASAP Rally's lawsuit, claiming that he shot his fellow rapper, saying his own negligence caused any injuries that he sustained. Please before we continue I will appreciate if you subscribe and hit notification bell so that you never miss out on any of our videos about your favorite celebrities. Rapper ASAP Rocky responded to a lawsuit filed by fellow rapper ASAP Rally, claiming that he shot him. ASAP Rocky, whose real name is Rackham Mayers, is also facing aggravated assault charges connected to the shooting. Rocky claimed that Relly was shot due to his own negligence, according to court documents. ASAP Rocky was arrested in April shortly after returning from vacation with his girlfriend Rihanna and charged with counts of aggravated assault in connection with the shooting. Rihanna was pregnant at the time of Mayer's arrest and the couple has since had a child. Mayer's has pleaded not guilty to both charges. Mayer's attorney, Joe Takapina, told Insider that Mayer's did not commit a crime. Takapina said in a statement that it was an extortion attempted by a former associate who threatened to make false criminal accusations if Rocky didn't pay him. What will become abundantly clear in the upcoming months, based on facts and evidence, is that Rocky is innocent of these charges, Takapina said in the statement. Attorneys for ASAP Rally, whose real name is Terrell Efren, did not immediately return insiders' requests for comment on Monday. Efren's lawsuit, which was filed on August 10, claims that he met with Mayers on November 6, 2021, at a recording studio in Los Angeles, where a verbal altercation ensued. During this altercation and while in close physical proximity to the plaintiff, the defendant pulled out a handgun and purposefully pointed it in the direction of the plaintiff and fired multiple shots, the lawsuit says. The lawsuit claims that Efren was struck by a bullet as a result of the incident and that most of the interaction was caught on video. Mayer's attorneys filed a response to the lawsuit on Thursday, claiming that any damages or injuries mentioned in the lawsuit were solely, directly and proximately, caused by the negligent and or intentional acts or omissions of Efren. The answer to the lawsuit says that if Efren sustained any injuries under the circumstances alleged in the complaint, they were caused solely by his own negligence, lack of due care, or they were the fault of his employees. The response asks that the court not award Efren any damages, compensate Mayers for his attorney's fees, and grant him any other relief that the court deems necessary. Let us know your thoughts in the comments section below, and please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss out on any updates about your favorite celebrities.